Here at Bassant Field, the Queens Field hockey team defeated the Coker Cobras to keep the winning streak alive and continue the hot start to the season. Uh, it was a good team effort. Uh, we really had to make some adjustments at halftime. We knew to expect a really, you know, aggressive, um, aggressive opponent today. So uh, we had to make the adjustment uh, going into halftime, making sure we were working to win 50-50 balls and really focused on playing our game. Um, and uh, yeah, just focus on possession. So Queens trailed 3-2 in the second half. When led by Carla Von Aaron's hat trick, the Royals rallied for a 6-3 come from behind victory. In the beginning we were definitely frazzled, playing kind of more down to their level and then we stopped, we took a breather when we had halftime, we came back out and our what we had said in the circle was let's just play Queens hockey. The victory marked the sixth consecutive win for the Royals, moving their overall record to 6-1. and one. Through four league games, Queens holds first place in the South Atlantic Conference Carolinas. That's that's our goal as a team. Um, we're taking one game at a time, and you know that is our goal is to be winning one game at a time. Um, you know, ultimately winning conference, and um, you know, hopefully going on to uh, NCAA's. So that's the expectation going into every day at practice. You know, that's how hard we're working and how focused uh, the team is on the field. 2018 marks the third year of competition for the field hockey program. In year one, Queens went 9-7, and seven, but just 6-11 and 11 in year two. However, through seven games in 2018, Queens is off to its best start in program history. Um, they want it. The team is very driven. Um, you know, we have uh, our goals set for the season, and we're kind of keeping our eye on the prize in that sense. The Royals will be on the road this Sunday to take on six-ranked Bloomsburg. It'll be a feature game for USA Field Hockey. For the Queens Sports Network, I'm Julia Osbrook.